you know, watching it last night, I had trouble figuring out exactly what Ari Aster's take is on uh, dealing with anxiety, because mm -hmm. it feels very much like a movie that's just like, there's nothing you can do to help. Everything that's the worst thing you can imagine happening in every situation will happen. Uh -huh. Even if you try to take your medicine, there's going to be some sort of problem. So I feel like the, for me, the movie, as someone who deals with anxiety, uh, I, I find that the, the movie, it almost felt good to have someone show you their worst thoughts. Like when, when I'm freaking out and I'm imagining, oh God, what if this happens and this happens? This movie is like, great, we'll show you everything, like mm -hmm. all the worst things. And there's this weird catharsis with watching someone go through that, that, uh, that I can kind of live through them safely on my couch. There's a large subculture of people on Reddit and on YouTube and all sorts of things that have like lots of theories about it. And like a lot of people were saying, like, I've never seen what I feel internally displayed on screen so accurately. Just reminds me of a quote I found from Astor describing what he was going for with this movie, but he said, it's not exploring a man's life so much as his experience, putting the viewer in his head, inside his feelings, hopefully on an almost cellular level.